guys, it's Tom here with some exciting news from New York Toy Fair. Okay, so we have the reveal of a brand new Mega Bloks license, Terminator Genesis. And this is going to be really cool, it's featuring loads of sets based on the brand new film, and it's just really, really exciting to see Mega pick up yet another awesome collector's license. So let's jump straight into the images. So the first image we have is of some kind of Skynet Walker, and this is really, really cool. Uh, it has a lot of nice details on it, some smooth bricks, some weapons chains, and it looks really, really cool. It comes with a T8, no, not 800, probably a T1000, something along those lines, uh, which looks really, really cool, the standard Terminator model. And we get a couple of resistance fighters in nice gear, with the RPG from the Call of Duty line included. And this is quite exciting, this is something which I don't think we've seen in any of the Terminator films to date. So it's definitely something that's going to be making its first appearance in Genesis. Hopefully we do see something like a Hunter Killer to complement this. That would be very nice. The next thing we have is what appears to be a teleporter, which is quite predominant in the trailer for Terminator Genesis. As this is what sends back in time both Arnie and uh, Kyle in order to go back and save or kill Sarah Connor, depending on who you look at. So this is quite exciting and it's nice to see a terrain piece in the first wave of the sets which is always a bonus and just as a little side note we do get a figure of Arnie in this set and this is really really cool he looks really cool he's got some skin damage to show the Terminator exoskeleton underneath and it looks really really nice as well as that you'll note that he does come with his signature shotgun and it is in fact painted which is again a nice detail and you'll note throughout the line that this line appears to use single cast weapons and not modular weapons like the Call of Duty line. I mean, if you take a look at the Rebel sets, we do get some very nice M4 carbines, which I'm quite excited to get a couple of. Lastly, we get this large resistance truck with a host of resistance fighters and a few Terminators too. This is really, really nice. The figures look good. Again, a nice variety amongst them. The truck itself looks good, and this is probably just a prototype build, and I'm quite excited to see what kind of role it plays within the new film. Again, I'm not sure if any of these figures are meant to resemble John Connor or not, or any of the other named characters, but for what we have on a first look at the line, this is a very nice addition, and I'm really excited to see all the potential it holds in the future. I mean, I would really love to get something like a Rebel... Uh, A10 Warthog or a Rebel Bell Huey helicopter. Okay guys, so that's it for this video. Just a quick look at the Terminator sets that have been revealed so far at New York Toy Fair. Credit to Toy Arc for the images. I'll leave a link in the description where you can go and check out their Mega Bloks gallery. And I am generally very, very excited to see what this line holds. As always guys, stay awesome and look forward to more videos in the near future.